with you. Cross my palms, well, silver. Someone gave me. You're going to hell. There's a war on drugs. It's a war on freedom. Excuse me, sir. Can I talk to you for a second? The fuck are you talking about? I am talking about a hotline straight to heaven that this state makes illegal. Yeah. This is what I'm talking about. I don't give a fuck about reefer. No, no, they rigged the vote. I saw the ballots. It's a lie. It's democracy at work, amigo. Democracy can suck my fatty. Democracy only works when it lets intelligent people do what they want. This, this is tyranny by morons. <laughs> yeah, well, I got things to take care of in a little place called reality. You want to drag? Nah, I'm not a drug guy. This isn't bushweed. This is mana. And I grow it myself. No paranoia, no weirdness. A passport to nirvana. Fuck, give me that. Yeah, here, you'll hardly feel it. Yeah, I smoke all day and I'm fine. It's a pure, mellow high. But I do get concerned about the monsters. Yeah. I mean... I'm sure they're nothing serious, but, uh, oh. I never let them get too near. Oh, the fuck is that? After that, you see, the liquor companies push for continued prohibition, which is complete insanity. <laughs> so I take it I can count on your support. The fuck just happened? What are you talking about? We discussed globalization, the state. Stay the fuck away from me. What? But it's a good cause.
Look out! What do you want? Man, I come by for that drink you offered, that's all. I wasn't really serious about that. What? Uh, you're here, whatever. Sit. You're not gonna rob me again. Man, I never robbed you. That was just a repossession. Okay. You call it whatever you want to call it. I really don't care. What can I do for you? Shit, I just came by to see if there's something I can help you with. I see you doing well for yourself. I'm retired. Ain't you a bit young for the pipe, slippers, and staring at a fucking sunset? You know, I've been in this game for a lot of years, and I got out alive. That makes me the right age. <clears throat> you look like a good kid, but if you want my advice, you give the shit up. You work hard, screw over everybody that you love. Hurt, rob, kill indiscriminately, and maybe, just maybe, if you're lucky, you become a three-bit gangster. It's bullshit. Go to college. Then you're gonna rip people off and get paid for it. It's called capitalism. Hmm. So what I saw the other day was like, when a corpse briefly reanimates itself and terrorizes everyone, right? What you saw the other day was a guy dealing with pests. I guess I never saw myself as just a fucking pest. Well... And today's lesson's all about humility. Tomorrow we'll try a training montage. A training what? No. I was just lost in an 80s movie fantasy. <laughs> yeah, I can see you spend a lot of time there. Yeah, as much as I can. So that's why you're here in Vinewood then, right? Maybe I'm here because I'm just an idiot. Who thinks that imported palm trees are a good substitute for not really knowing what the fuck you're doing on this earth. Jesus, man. You a good time, you know that? I'll tell you what, <sighs> least I can do is buy you that beer. There's a little bar I like. <sighs> it's not too far from here. Let's go. All right, man. I'm following you. We're taking my wife's car. Hey, Jim. I'm going for a drink. Dad! Wait. Shit! I mean, our boat going down the Western Highway! It's... it's been stolen! What? The yacht's been stolen? I, I was... Trying to sell it. I know you didn't want it sold, but I need money, and they don't want to buy it. They just want to take it. I'm hiding in the head. You're insane. All right, I'm coming for my boat. All righty then. Change of plans. My darling boy is in trouble. I do what I can to help with that, man. Lesson number one: Don't ever have kids. Hey, man, look, if I had kids, I don't think no parenting issues would arise over who I had both privileges and who don't. Shit, motherfuckers would be lucky to sit in a bathtub. Shit, things that desperate, huh? Nah, but, you know, shit, I was making a point. Pathologizing self-deprecation. 
I know it well. Yeah, man, but shit, where the boat at? Little shit's been hijacked. They're somewhere on the Western Highway. Man, ain't you worried? About my boat? Yeah, I am. But you can always buy another boat. Yeah, tell my accountant that. Man, you can always get credit for one. But have you come repo it? No, thank you. <laughs> All right, homie. I ain't your homie. I'm someone you want to impress. Really? Man, I thought you was retired. Why the fuck do I want to impress some slipper wearing motherfucker? Because I can still teach you a thing or two. Maybe help you open the door to all the joys that boat-related parenting issues entail. Oh! There! There! There it is! That's my boat! Your boat's in a fucking hurry, man. Yeah, well, we'll catch him. Hey, what we about to do? I'm gonna get you close, and you're gonna go board that thing. All right, man, shit. Fuck it, let's do this. All right, I got a piece in the glove box. They give you shit, I'll take them out. All oh, that's cool, man. You shoot them with one hand and drive them with the other. But my motherfucking concern is, I might let you jump and fall in fucking trap. You said you wanted to learn from the best. Let's go this lesson number one. Whoa, whoa! There you go, kid. Oh, fuck this. Fuck! Ah! Shop back there, dog. You drive us there, we can get the ride fit. My boat. It's just a thing. My boat. Please stop doing that. Listen, I fucked up, okay? I'm not going to lie. That was a really bad judgment call. But shit, Dad, I nearly died. And all you give a shit about is this fucking boat. No, it's not that. It's all we do is scream at each other. No wonder I can't get a job. It's all your fucking fault. Or... It's not, but it's partly your fault. I, I mean, I just want to impress you. By selling my boat to some gangbangers? I know it sounds dumb when you put it like that, but all you do is daydream or get angry. Look, I love you, Jimmy, but you're an asshole. And right now, with my boat disappearing over the horizon, that's all I can see. Franklin, would you do me a favor and give this kid a ride home after they fix this thing? I want to headbutt the road in peace. Oh, great! Leave me with the home invader! I'll get it done, dog. No problem. Dad! Enough! All right? Enough! Franklin, do me a favor. Call me a taxi, will you? No problem. Hey, I need a cab as soon as you can send one. Los Santos Customs, by the airport. All right, thanks. Thanks, man. 
Hey, so you uh do much yachting? Not anymore. No, I don't. Before, I mean, man. No, nah, not really. This little shit stays in his room all day, and I don't have any other people to go with, you know? I like looking at it. Hey, this the place up here. I know this dude, man. His name How. He gonna look after him. So you sure you're good? Yeah, I got this. All right. Ooh, uh, I'm gonna come up front. Get out and walk around. It's okay, I can just climb over. Look, man, I'm gonna get the ride fixed, man, and drop it back off at your house along with this dude. It's all good, though, man. You go and get your head right, all right? All right, listen, thanks for today. I appreciate it. You stop back out to the house, we'll talk. Ugh, you see? So, man. Hey, sorry we didn't get your boat, man. Yeah. Come on, man. Let's trick this whip, homie. Trick this whip or what? Still need to get you out for one of the races, Franklin. See if you drive as fast as you talk. There, we can dish like day you bought. Sweet. Oh, oh! You gonna do this thing, or we got to bounce? All right, man, I'm taking you home. It's Franklin, right? Yeah, Franklin. Or the credit for our guy. The home invader. You know what? Call me what you like, man. Yeah, I, I, no, I, I mean, sure. Jimmy, ain't he? Or James? Jimmy. Or just like, Jizzle? <laughs> no, nah, man, I'll just stick with Jimmy, homie. So, uh, what's the deal, man? Huh? You and my old man? I see you at the dealership, and someone steals my whip, and Papa's all like, he's been down there to talk to you guys. Your pops did more than talk. What'd he do? Look, man, if he ain't tell you, I ain't gonna tell you. But I lost my fucking job, and I thought maybe he could help me find a new one. Dude, my dad is retired. Like, fully? Like, his only marketable skills are watching TV and daytime drinking. <sighs> man, look, I don't know, homie. He seems okay to me. Shit, he saved your ass. You saved my ass. Nah, nah, man. Well, well, maybe we good together, you know? Like, maybe we can get shit done we couldn't do separate. If it keeps him out of the house, that's cool by me. Yeah, well, we'll see. Look, I'm sorry my dad lost to your job. It's hard out there. Tough. I mean, I'm employmentally challenged at the moment. Oh, you got fired, dude. Damn, that's rough. Not fired as such. I didn't get a job. I've been there, homie. You've been putting them resumes out there, but no one's hiring them. No, I, uh, I didn't get a job. I've never had a job. It feels like hard work. Life, the days just kind of disappear. Hey, you play right to slaughter? Nah, not since the first couple. Okay. Yo, so like, since we're both unemployed, like, we could run together, you know? Yeah, I think about it, homie. Or, or we could just like, shop it, you know? Play darts or get our drink on, strip clubs. Come on, dude, I get real crazy. Yeah, I got your number, shit. I need it, man. But, uh, hey, hey, you know what? Man, go easy on your pops, dog. all right? All right, church. <laughs> exactly, man. My brother from another mother. I mean, I, I hope so, because my mom was kind of a skank back in the day. See ya. Yeah, whatever, homie. Peace.
What's up, homie? Hey, look. Chop got to stay around your crib for a while, homie. That's cool? Yeah, man, it's cool. Shit's the best place for him anyway. Ha! <laughs> like it ain't nobody out there gunning for your black ass. Bullshit, nigga. Just take care of it, man, all right? All right, I got you, dawg. Stop happening to me. Fuck now to fuck my wife in my own bed. Hey, you! Stop What's it! What's up, man? Get out of my way. Michael, calm down. What the fuck is going on? Nothing happened. It was a misunderstanding. She fucked the frick in my bed. <laughs> you bullshitting me. It wasn't like that. You in? Fuck it. I'm in. Let's roll. Let's get this motherfucker. Just don't kill him. You okay, homie? What happened? The guy bounced my wife is what happened. Which guy? The guy I'm paying to teach her tennis. The tennis coach? Oh, that's fucked up, man. Who is dudes, homie? You know, back in the hood, man, we gotta watch out for the mailman, dog. Yeah, I'm a cook all the snob and a fucking cliche. He gone left. Creeping on this asshole. The fuck is he? Throw some more hip, you stupid hippie fuck! Fuck, man, I think we lost his ass. He lives somewhere up in the canyon. We'll find him. Ah, the fuck is he? It's this track here. Hey! In one of these fucking houses. Yeah, keep your eye out. That's his car, right there. Little prick's up there, look. Oh, shit, Cole's doing all right for himself. Hey, asshole! You ran off before we could settle our debts! Michael, what? You got the wrong idea, man! He's about to have a real clear idea where I'm coming from. There's a winch in the back of the truck. Tied a cable to one of those supports up there. You finna pull his deck down? Hey, that prick pulled my marriage down. Man, you really gonna be this fucking dramatic? Yeah, whatever. I told you I comped the session, bud! Well, there were a lot of freaking sessions, bud! I'm thinking you were working on more than just her backhand. Mandy's backhand has come a long way, bro. But sometimes it's gotta get worse to get better. Yeah, well, maybe I should come up there and practice my backhand. On your face! Oh. Bud, your negative energy is seriously bringing me down. Oh, I hope it is, bud. We hooked up, man. You come into my house, take my money, and nail my wife? Are you fucking kidding me? I'm gonna stick up my hand and say that was uncool, bud. My bad. Seriously. Oh, how fucking magnanimous. May I please offer you my applause? You fucking motherfucker! Dude! And we'll see how you like it when someone fucks with your shit! Well, hey! Wait! You got the wrong idea, pal! Whoa! Fuck! Here we go! Ha-ha! <laughs> Let's see what happens! Dude, you are probably crazy! <laughs> oh! Yeah. You see this shit, dog? Oh, hell yeah, homie. You know what time it is. Man, I think that shit's coming down, man. Yeah, he gonna feel this one, dog. Oh! <laughs> Really trying to pull that dude house off the fucking hill? Hey, we were trying to teach him a fucking lesson. Now that's an expensive bitch ass lesson, man. Maybe he'll keep it on the court and out of my wife. Yeah, he not taking no housewives back to that motherfucker. Hey, it's a service to the fucking community. Mr. DeSanta, what the hell? That's not my house! 
Oh, man, why don't you look at... oh, bro, I couldn't afford a place like that. I'm a tennis coach. I hit balls for a living. I was just hiding there. Give me a phone. You! You're a dead one! Green light! Green light! Shit, we got some heavies on us, homie. Are you kidding me? Kid, can you do something? I'll give it a go, man. Keep trying. If you got a piece, now's the time to use it. How much distance we got between us? I got one! There you go! Hey, let's go! Let's leave them behind! Can you see them? Are they still back there? You gonna use that gun? We got a book, man. Go! All right, we managed to lose him? Shoot that gun, kid! That's what it's for! Crash! Push the pedal, man. We gotta move! How much distance we got between us? Hey, let's go! Let's leave him behind! What is this shit? Got a book, man. Go. I snap, motherfucker. This a misunderstanding, motherfucker. Yeah, my nigga, that's it. All right, let's go back. Wow. Shit. You did good. I mean, your aim's all over the place, but you were a help. Ah, uh, thanks. I guess. Hey, don't get defensive. Go to a shooting range. Work on your aim. You'll do fine. Fuck, man. Shit, you good? Fine as wine. I got a few knocks. You okay? I mean, you did good, kid. Man, I'm cool, man. I mean, you. Mentally. Mentally? Oh, man. I'm fucking excellent. My heart ain't bumped like that in years. Oh! Yes! Fucking A, Bubba! Man, you sound kind of man. You just been greenlit by the Mexican underworld ambassador to Los Santos. Trust me. We handled it. Whoever the fuck Martin Madrazo is, I've known worse. We just handled a few low-ranking clients. We sit on it, we see what happens. Kid, there's no use second-guessing. Hey, thanks for the help out there today, kid. I had no idea it was gonna get that hot. Shit, pulling houses off the hillside? Show has a weird way of fucking with people. Yeah, well, I thought I was through with all that shit. I don't know what the hell's going on. Oh, shit, I think we're about to find out. Do you know who I am? Do you know who I am? Do you? No. Who are you? You? I think so. Good. I know who you are. I know where you live. Who are you? I'm Franklin. License. No. Franklin. Maybe help Mr. DeSanta here. Who am I? I think Martin Madrazo. Good boy. Now, maybe give him a little of a background. Man, Mr. Madrazo... It, Mr. Madrazo is a legitimate businessman who was wrongfully accused of running a Mexican-American gang and a narcotic ring, but the charges were dropped because of the witnesses came up missing. Smart kid. Now, Michael, I've got a question for you. What did you pull an architectural, significant, modernist, wonder home down the hillside in Vinewood Hills? I thought the owner was banging my wife. Well, that was a strange house for a tennis coach. <sighs> I wasn't thinking straight. Mm, clearly. Yeah. <sighs> well, Natalia will <sighs> need a hotel while you finance the rebuild, won't she? Sure. Good. And I'm guessing here that the rebuild uh, will be somewhere in the 2.5 million range. <laughs> of course. Great. That's nice. 
Come on, man. Damn, you all right? Never better. So what now? Looks like I'm gonna have to postpone my retirement. Fuck. Ah, oh, man, I'm mortgaged up to my eyeballs. Look, I only know one way to make money. I'm gonna have to give an old friend a call. Lester. I think he's in town somewhere. I'm gonna have to track him down. Just give me a little alone time, all right? All right, dog. Is this still the number for Lester Crest? Who's asking? Who's asking? Who's asking? You're awful cagey. <laughs> <clears throat> Even for a dead man, Michael. Ooh, you don't sound good, buddy. <laughs> Tactful and charming, even in death. Hey, come see me, old friend. I'm living in Los Santos, just like you. Marietta Heights. Whoa, whoa, wait. Hey, how do you... Hello? You fucker.